Today I have the Ceramic Santa for $14.99 from Hobby Lobby. I did get him at 50% off. And I'm going to start by using my S30 Klingon brush. This can be found at chalkitupfancy.com. And applying Snow Owl as my first coat. And this is just, even though he's white, it's ceramic. So that white coat is just going to uh, seal the ceramic. So I'm starting with uh, Republic Red on his hat. And I'm using a small angled art brush. Guys, it's nothing fancy. I probably picked it up at Dollar General and a pack of other brushes. But it does have a little angle on it. And it is helping me keep my lines pretty straight and not running into other sections. And I'm just going to use this red on the hat. And then I'm going to start on the coat. And I'm just going around and I'm leaving anything that I'm going to keep white or another color. And if you ever decide to grab one of these ceramic pieces, you don't have to really worry about perfection, okay? We're just gonna go through the best that we can and cover the different areas. I mean, he's basically red, white, and black, so it's not that difficult. And now I'm going into the bottom half of the coat and skipping over the belt and all the lined fur. Now I'm gonna paint his face white and then I'm gonna go in with Republic Red and blending the two colors together, I'm gonna to create more of a pinkish tone. I'm just gonna go back and forth until I get it all blended in. And I'm gonna use black and just make two dots for the eyes and a little dot of red between where his mouth is gonna be, between the mustache. I'm painting the base of him black. Once my project was completely done, I did go back and paint the complete bottom black, but you're not gonna see that in this video. And now I'm going in and taking care of the belt making that black. I believe the pack of brushes at Dollar General are about $3.50. And all the paint can be found at chalkitupfancy.com. We do have paint bundles. I believe they have these colors in those bundles. So there you go. Now at this point, I'm gonna take my salve and my two inch palm brush, also can be found at chalkitupfancy.com. And it's basically wipe on, wipe off. My salve is scented in tobacco flower. You can get it in unscented. And salve is just a essential oil wax that you can use as a sealer for furniture, objects, or you can refresh any leather or wood so now I'm taking my S30, some water, and a little bit of black. And I wet my brush so this black is going on damp. And remember we did this last week with the bells. This is another way you can use this. And so all that painting, whether it was perfect or not, this is going to cover that. And it's going to bring everything to a whole new level by taking my baby wipe and wiping the black back. And you can leave as much black or as little black as you want. And it's going to stay there just caught in all the crevices. And I believe it looks better like this. Some may disagree with me. So this is very easy. You're going to do this in sections because you don't want your paint to dry. And you're going to do it kind of quickly. And you're going to brush it all on and making sure you... You get all that black and especially the white areas and you wipe it back with your baby wipe. Now, once everything dried, I took my uh, Cleopatra gold and filled in his buckle 
And then I realized I forgot the loops in his in his coat, the belt loop area, and I painted that red. And now once all that dried, I took my two inch palm brush and my salve again and gave him a final top coat, buffed on, buffed off, and allowed him to dry. Guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. For other tutorials, go check us out on YouTube. You can now watch all our videos at chalkitupfancy.com for any paint products, salve, any other sealers, tissue paper, or transfers, chalkitupfancy.com. Thank you so much for watching.